Hey, it's Rokaz, your digital lifestyle expert here, and I have got a magic trick for you. Look, nothing up my sleeves. We've got a MacBook Air running OS X here, and watch this. Whoop, boop. Now, don't fear. Yes, it is a MacBook Air running Windows XP. <laughs> Listen, and it's not hard to do. If you've ever feared about getting a Mac in order from the fact that you may have to turn your back on other Windows programs, well, as you can see here, and this is not some kind of camera trick or digital illusion, I am actually running Windows XP on my computer. Uh, I go to it for areas where, and you can see over here, QuickBooks, which does have a Mac version, but my accountant says it's not as stable and or he's afraid to use it. So anyways, we do have to to do some of our accounting using uh, using the uh, the Windows based um, uh, QuickBooks, but that doesn't stop me. I do it right here on my Mac platform. Guys, remember, as a general rule, Mac likes to play ball with Windows. Windows not so much with Mac. Now, when you're talking about installing Windows or Windows XP onto a Mac computer, you have two choices. One is to go the route that I went down, and of course, I recommend that as your digital lifestyle expert, because here you can see that. Actually, I am running two operating systems simultaneously. This is not a Windows emulator. This is not a front page. This is not just graphics to make it look, make my XP look like I'm running, uh, excuse me, my OS look like I'm running Windows XP. I'm actually running them to a, a virtual machine and running them side by side. In order to do that, you need a piece of third party software. Um, in this case here, I'm running VM. Where Fusion uh, Parallels is also another company that sells these virtual machine programs for the Mac. What you need to do is to purchase them and to install them. They can be done at their respective Straight websites on. online and just go ahead and download them and install them. Now, here's the other thing is, is that you need to own a copy of Windows XP, a legal copy of it, so you can load it in there. Once this is done, uh, both uh, VMware Fusion and Parallels will walk you step by step on how to create another machine. These programs also will allow you to run other virtual machines machines, including uh, Linux and other operating systems simultaneously on your computer. Now, it's important to understand, too, that your computer can be, your Mac can also be a full Windows machine. Yes, it is possible to purchase a Mac and start its life and make it only a Windows computer. Now, I know that blows your mind, and seriously, that is an excellent way to go. Even if you say to yourself, hey, I hate, I hate uh, uh, Mac OS X, I am a Windows lover, your still best choice for hardware is the Mac computer. In fact, when Vista, when Vista first was launched, the cover of PC Magazine said the best computer to run Vista on is a Mac. And, and that is done by its built-in boot camp function. Uh, in settings, all you have to do is launch the boot camp, and it'll run you through how to install Windows XP. And when you turn your computer on, it boots up only as a Windows-based computer. So there's a difference. You can either run them simultaneously or choose one or the other. So you can have your cake and eat Windows too. Just like me, Rokaz, your digital lifestyle expert, saying, stream you later.